All right, guys. So at the beginning of every week, I will be doing shout outs to my new subscribers. So continue to watch. If I didn't call you now, maybe because it didn't pop up on my feed, but when it pops up, best believe I'll be shouting your name out. Sound. Well, guys. All right, guys. So, as you all probably know, because you are my coffee beans, I have reached 700 subscribers. Actually, I've gone over 700 subscribers now in the last few days. I hit 700 and it's just been climbing. So, I want to say thank you to everybody. But since I am at 700, I am going to be kind of doing my shout outs to people for subscribing because I appreciate that guys. I love it. Thank you so much. So if your name appears in my subscriber list, then I'll be able to read it off. But I'm right now I'm at 720 and I can only read off the profiles that are public. So if I missed your name and you subscribed, Thank you very much. It's just not on my list. And I'm only going from 700 to now. So everybody that's been with me like forever, you know I appreciate you guys. You know I love you. Thank you so much. So let's get started. One, two, three. The breaking news. Shout out to the breaking news. Shout out to Tamara Gabriella. Stephanie Jones Taylor. Thank you. Leatherman38. Thank you. Pet Love 214. I know you. Thank you. Much love. Mwah. Gabrielle Polydor. Thank you. New Start with Eugenia. Tisha Felicia. Monastery James, I know you. Yolanda Bovastro. Chris Meddy. Evelyn Hawkins. Vin, you. Everything Dash Erica. Eric Ortega. Jennifer Humphreys. Dylan Orton. Thiago Ricardo Dorego. I hope I didn't botch that. And the last one that I have here is Brown Sugar 35. Thank you, each and every one of you. I appreciate your support. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for becoming a coffee bean, man. That's love. Thank you so much. All right. Look at my daughter's hair. Oh, sorry. Good morning, coffee beans. Now, look at my daughter's hair. I blow dry and flat ironed her hair last night. And then I put this cute waterfall braid in because I've been practicing and I still need more practice with it. But after trying it over and over and over and over and over a few times on her hair last night, I finally got it and it was so pretty. And I'm like, hey, I'm gonna show all the coffee beans her beautiful waterfall braid that I put in her hair. And she took it out. it out I'm gonna put it back in there it was so cute guys but I am going to get it and when I get it perfect then I'm gonna probably video how to do it because it well maybe because I don't do a lot of French braiding or corn rolling the way some people call it so it's a little bit more difficult for me I can I can French braid but trying to figure out what parts to drop and stuff with that waterfall braid it's a little challenging and like I've, I've created what I like to call modified braids because it doesn't have 
it has the waterfalls coming out, but it's not the right string, but it still looks cute. But I want it to look exactly like some of the ones that I saw. So anyway, you gonna say anything to the coffee beans? I'm tired. She's tired. It's after 11 o'clock and she just woke up. Hmm, I think that means that somebody needs to go to bed a little bit earlier at night. What do you think? Mm, no. Yeah, so if you can't get up before no. 11. I'm, I woke up at 11 before when you had me go to bed at 10. Mm-hmm. Well, maybe I should make you go to bed at 9. No, that's not even on my school bedtime. Yeah, maybe I need to decrease your bedtime. No. Yeah. No. All right, so I still got to go get my doggy, guys. I, did, I didn't even go. I got my eyebrows waxed yesterday. I need to go and get um, pick Gus up, but I think I might leave him over there one more day. Just because I'm going to Grace's The One singing competition tonight, guys. She is at the end. She's in it for 10 grand. And there are five people left. So if she wins tonight, she wins 10 grand. So, I'm going to be there, and then uh, I'm not doing anything after that. Also, today is my little brother's birthday. Today is Uncle Michael's birthday? Yes. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. What are you going to do for him? Mm -hmm. I was going to take him out, but I got to check my phones. He doesn't know. He's at work right now. I talked to him for a little while this morning. He's going to call me back. He's not doing anything today that I know of said he didn't have any plans so so we'll see what happens maybe I'll take him out or something I don't know <laughs> I bought those for me so what are you eating them for <laughs> they're too sweet for me but I'm gonna eat them because they're expensive you guys ever buy these I bought it because of the chile lime or chili lime look at me chile and I thought it would be have more of a salty kind of flavor to them but they taste like sweet lime and I don't as, or it's, it's lime, but it's got a sweetness to it. I don't like sweet meat. It's not nasty, but when I'm eating meat, yes, it is. it's not nasty. When I'm eating meat, I want salty. I don't want sweet when I'm eating meat. So I'm going to eat that, but I won't buy those again. So she wanted her hair straightened, guys, because she wanted to see if it's almost back to the length that it was before we it's cut it. Yes, it is. It's over halfway there. Her hair used to be down to here. And then two years ago, we cut it to about that long uh, in the back and kind of, it was like a bob. Uh, we're not going to go into details as to why we cut it, but we had to cut it. And look how long it's grown back in two years. When I came out of the shower yesterday and brought detailing my hair when it was curly, it was like right here. No, it wasn't. So it wasn't. You thought it was. No. Anyway, I looked in the mirror. by this time next year, her hair is going to be back down to her butt, and then she can stop complaining that her hair is short. There is no way that that child's hair is short. Yes, there is. No way. Like, yes, if my hair grew as fast as hers does, I would be such a happy person. Like, I would, would love it. But it doesn't grow as fast as hers grows. If I could attain that length in two years, I have so many people trying to figure out what my trick was or what kind of magic I was using because we know that that is not humanly possible, right? Right. All right. I'll see you guys a little bit later. I need to <clears throat> kind of finish cleaning my house up some and figuring out what I'm going to do with my life. My husband today. just got his motorcycle license. He just learned how to ride. I'm going to go for a ride around a block with him. Pray for me. I get back in one piece. Yeah, I need that. survived it 
I survived the motorcycle ride. Actually, it was pretty fun. It was pretty fun. I I have to. Um, he's gonna want to buy a bike now. <sighs> but that was pretty cool. It's um, it's it was fun. It was really fun. I haven't been on a bike since I was like 18 years old. And then when I did, when I was on a bike, like I wouldn't let the guy go fast because I felt like I was gonna blow off the bike. So this was a little bit different. This was better. And it wasn't a Harley Davidson. It was a, um, I guess it was like a little a red crotch rocket. I don't know, but I would not let that guy move faster than like 15 miles an hour. So I know he really hated having me on that bike. So one of my friends when I was a teenager, huh? Anyway, that was fun. So. And then hubby is going to be going to Bourbon Street tonight so that we can both support Grace. So, and other than that, he's basically gonna be on that bike all day. He's just riding around everywhere. So, good for him, let him have some fun. There's my honey, back on that bike. You're so silly. Oh, when he said, um. You guys want to see this bike? Right I'll let you see the bike. It's a nice bike. This is the bike that my husband is so enamored. In enamored, or however you say and it. And it's still making noise. What? I know, it's clicking. Nice, nice though, isn't it, guys? I found the engine too. That's the engine. I don't know what anything is. It's just a cool looking bike. But I found it. Where did you sit? Right here. You sit there, you put your feet right here, and then you wrap your arms around Daddy. It's fine, Lex. All right, whatever. I'll go for another ride with him. What? I need to run. I'm turning the air out. I need to run upstairs and stuff. Even relax on the front porch without you guys bothering me. Look at him. Look at him. I'd be running across my yard right now if I was in the backyard. Look how. Oh, people will say that's a baby one, but that don't look like a baby. I know there's. I know I've seen something bigger than that in my backyard. Ooh. Get away from me. Like the fly is making me trip out now. Look at his tail. Still, goo. Where is he going? I came out here to read, guys. I came out here to work on my Bible study. And he interrupted me. How rude. Where is he going? Ooh, I don't know if he's slithering that way or this way. Oh, he's going on in the ground, like under the porch. Or maybe under the porch. Look at <laughs> Look at his tail. It's sticking out. Look, he's going under my porch, guys. Look at him. Slither right on in the cracks. Jump over the last step. Oh, those things. All right. Let's go watch Grace sing, shall we?